start ladies and gentlemen in the morning i met a few of you at a formal occasion i am happy to meet you all once again now and share with you some of the thoughts which are in my mind i have been called to a high office by the people of the country we have by and large adopted the constitution of england for our country that gives me a position which is very high with great power and honor but without much work although every action of the government is taken in my name i do not have the burden for all that is done either by the government at the center or in the states that does not mean that i have nothing to do and i am holding an office with pay and without work it places me in a happy position to view the actions of government all over the country from a detached position we have chosen a democratic form of government for our country with a written constitution the members of the government and the party which is in the majority are governed by the constitution as much as the members of the opposition <coughs> each has his rights and responsibilities to the country we may sometimes probably neglect the responsibilities and insist too much on the rights in my visits i have seen most parts of the country more than once and if i say anything which you do not like please do not think that i am referring to you neither it is my desire nor do i wish such a thing takes place between us that is because there are signs which need to be looked into and which need to be overcome without any loss of time if possible at all dear sirs we are in 
receipt of your letter of the third instead pointing out some mistakes in our bill of the 20th march we are sorry for the mistakes which were due to the negligence on the part of our typist who was looking after the work of bills of your area as his work showed many such mistakes in the past few weeks we were forced to dismiss him as it is our custom to insist on accuracy in our business we hope you will excuse this lapse for which we shall make proper allowance we also assure you that such mistakes will not occur in future we look forward to your valued orders thanking you yours faithfully